Well, the rain has been lashing down in the build-up to the game, and it's still lashing down here at Anfield. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary, as always, is Lee Dixon. We've got action from the round of 16 in the Champions League to bring you. It is Liverpool facing RB Leipzig. Yeah, thanks, Derek. My favourite part of the competition. Only 16 teams left. Group stages out of the way. The big teams come alive. It's the pointed end of the tournament. Gets everybody's attention. It's certainly got mine. I'm very excited. And number 10, Shadil Mane. Cup at Champions League stage and a round of 16 tie always Lee whets the appetite of their supporters well it does European Champions five times every Liverpool supporter you speak to will remind you of that fact because they're very proud of it and quite rightly so and this is how Liverpool start the game Joe Gomez starts alongside Virgil van Dijk in central defence. Thiago starts with Jordan Henderson in the centre of the pitch. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. The opposition starting 11. A standard 4-4-2, a formation you know well from your playing days, Lee. Yeah, I like this formation, Derek. It's very, very important that when they haven't got the ball, they all stick together. Very solid look about it. When they don't have the ball, very important that they stay close together in midfield. The back four will link across the width of the pitch, but they've got to help the forwards. The two up front need width. Teamwork might be the key. Targets available. Cross comes in. Jordan Henderson has lost possession. Can they get themselves in front here? Corner coming up. Now Origi. And Mane. Oh, he's through here. Only the keeper to beat. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. has given a penalty following that clumsy challenge and how important is this well a big chance to go into the lead from 12 yards what an opportunity to go for the short corner electing to cross into the center not really the ideal clearance well, let's see what he has in store for them and now jordan henderson and fabinho opportunity it is and a goal courtesy of mohammed salah his side in front to their delight Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, a bit more analysis as regards the goal. Yeah, who can 
forget that and I think Liverpool would love that to be happening again they've got the talent they've got the drive he's taken on the shorts but he's failed to beat the goalkeeper from there Lee well it was well worth the effort but uh, well off target Alexander Arnold and the referee has deemed that an additional four showing fine vision geometric precision from Thiago and Sadio Mane finishes with a plum well I think the keeper's expecting power He's expecting the laces to come right through that ball, but he just passes it into the net. A lovely, lovely finish. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. They've given it away. Going through Mane. And a goal! Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. And so this first leg is no more. The referee blows for full time. And European nights mean so much to Liverpool. They find themselves with the advantage going into the return match. Well, almost job done. Another leg to come. But it seemed like they were in total control tonight. The conclusion of this game is yet to come. But most of the hard work has been done. Football's been the winner tonight. Good evening to you from a city that has become one of Germany's most visited in recent years. We're in Leipzig. My name is Derek Ray, and with me for commentary is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And Liverpool have put themselves in a wonderful position ahead of the second leg of this tie in the UEFA Champions League. It's RB Leipzig taking on Liverpool. Well, in that first leg, Derek, Liverpool were in total command. Dominated up front, brilliant in midfield, solid at the back, goalkeeper was not bad either, absolutely brilliant. like a conventional 4-4-2 a preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal two main strikers four across the midfield really important for the fullbacks to link up with the wide midfielders in this system This is how Liverpool start the game. 
And you tend to know what you're going to get tactically from this team. High pressing. Well, high pressing, high energy. I played this system at Arsenal many a year under George Graham. It doesn't half work when it works well. Sometimes you can just get exposed to the back, but they've got it down to a tee, to be fair. And now this Champions League round of 16, second leg is underway. Virgil van Dijk. Now, what can he do here? Useful looking ball. And the goal has been scored by Mohamed Salah. in the back of the net. A chance to revisit the goal. Roberto Firmino. Geometric precision from Thiago. And Salah! He saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. Sadio Mane now. Going through Mane. Sadio Mane off the flank. Splendid save from the keeper, danger averted. Yeah, he didn't have long to react to that, but you have to praise his reflexes there. And on the second half here, and it's almost, Lee, a case of whatever they've touched has turned to goals. Well, for Liverpool... Sadio Mane! And they've only gone and applied that finishing touch. Keita, sat running towards goal, one man to beat, big chance it is, well he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves, great goalkeeping. Well he's denied a certain goal there, great reflexes from the keeper. And the referee ends this contest, Liverpool are the side to progress. Well, Derek, what confidence that will give him. A huge margin to go through into the next round. Played very, very well. That confidence, you can use that. You have to. It's like gold dust. Go into the next round with that confidence. Who knows where they can go?